Well, hello and welcome. Today I have an exciting video, you guys. I did it. I ordered from that new store online called Timu. Now, I'm gonna say right up front, we have zero affiliation with the store, so I'm not getting paid for this. I am just giving you my honest opinion because anybody who knows me knows I'll give it to you. A lot of my friends actually and I have been talking about it. It's very similar to Sheen or Shen or Shien, however you want to pronounce it. Exact same interface on your phone. It's exact same website. So it's basically the same thing. First off, I want to say a welcome. I am Lisa from the Yoho's. Now today, Mark, my partner in crime, is not in this video. He is out at work today. So it's just me telling you like it is. Now, you guys, we've all been down that rabbit hole. You go online late in the evening thinking, hmm, I wonder what this website is like. We do have a couple of trips coming up in the summer, if that ever gets here. So I kind of want a couple of jazzier outfits. So of course I hopped on this new site and let me just tell you, it came in two packages, totally fine. Now, half of this stuff that I ordered is mostly crafts and things that I kind of wanted to give it a whirl. Now, the first package, I'm going to be honest with you, I've opened it. Mark recorded it. For some reason, the audio wasn't the greatest. So I thought, you know what? That's annoying to listen to like static in the background. So I have already seen this first package. First package got delivered all the way down the street to my neighbors. Like what? And then the second package came with Canada Post and went to the mailbox and then I had to go to the post. Anyways, it was a long story. I will show you that on the second half of the video and that's gonna be my true reaction to the things because I had no idea and I was so excited to get the second package because it was the bigger package and it had my things in it that I didn't know until I opened the first package. So let's just jump right in. Let me show you what was in the first package and I'm gonna tell you what I think about it, whether you like it or not. <laughs> So we got new chairs near the end of the year last year. I guess it was almost halfway through after our first porch video was up um, for a spring porch. And I, the cushions are like a cream color, but I wanted like a couple of throw cushions for the chairs. Of course I did. So that was one of the things that I was actually looking for. It didn't necessarily have to be matching. I didn't necessarily need a two pack, but until I came across these little gems. Guys, they are thick. Like, they're really thick. And I'm very impressed with them. So, and it was a two pack. They had no insert and I kind of winged it. I didn't know what kind of pillow. I was hoping that this, I guess it's called a lumbar pillow, that would fit in this cushion cover, but I didn't know and I just winged it. Cause I figured worst came to worst. I can just cut like a pillow and like in half or kind of wiggle it. Anyways, MacGyver it to fit into here. But good news, they fit in the little lumbar pillow that I have on my bed and I'm pretty excited about it. Yes to these, yes, yes to these. I would order these again, no problem. They did come in different colors. I don't really remember the colors, but that is that. Let's move on to the next thing. The second thing that I got, not in this any order, of course, because I'm just kind of randomly grabbing them. They are literally packed up in a bunch of packaging, which I didn't love, but what can you do? And they're kind of just all kind of crammed into a bag. That's how it came in a big orange bag. So now this little thing is for Q-tips. How cute. Do you remember when you went into a restaurant and they had like the little toothpick holder? <laughs> so wacky. I loved me a good restaurant that had the cinnamon ones. Is that weird? The cinnamon toothpicks in a little package? No, anybody? Any? Anyways, I did get one for Mark and I and for the girls. This is for the girls' bathroom because, I don't know, it's just clear and I thought it was kind of cute. Ours, I think I got the one with the bamboo lid for us. So it was a nice little surprise because it's fairly sturdy. Bonus. So yes to that too. So now, you guys, this is important. Now, if this isn't a big deal. I feel like it was only a couple of dollars. But I need to tell you something. Make sure you read the description because sometimes if you don't read the description, it's kind of disappointing when you get it. I will put these to good use. They are little labels. Like how cute are those? So now they are paper, which is kind of neat. They're sticky, but like I did expect them to be a little bit bigger. But again, that is on me. That is my problem and not Timu's problem. They did put that in the description and I just, I was like, yes, I'll put that in my bag. <laughs> like filled up the shopping bag and ran right over to that till and paid online. 
Um, so yeah, so that was my problem. I would get these again. I'm just gonna put them in my craft stash because I'm sure I'll be able to find a use for them. So now, this next thing, I was kind of excited about it. Being a hairdresser, I love all of the fun little doodads for my hair or for our kids' hair, whatever. But this little thing, I thought, how cute is that? And like bring loaded, big time spring loaded. I actually wore it in my hair the other day. So let me show you how I did that. It is very easy to put in. It's a spring loaded. And just one second, I'll show you. So my hair is very fine. It doesn't look it right now because it's big and fuzzy. But all you do is as if you're gonna make a ponytail and put it right in there, in there, and just tie it up. There. Easy peasy, a lemon, so easy. Now, this last thing. I thought this was kind of neat. Now, again, I was very, I'm not gonna say disappointed because I totally knew I, it was kind of a sight unseen for all of this stuff. It's not that big of a deal. I know I'm gonna definitely put this to use and I think I already know what I want to do for them. Maybe sooner than later, but I'm not sure. Let me just show you this now. Like how cute is that? It's a silicone mold or hair dry clay is what I'm gonna use it for. I feel like it's probably for fondant for cake. I was pretty excited about that. Like how stinking cute with like earrings. <laughs> so that little guy is stinking cute. And yes, I'm glad I got this. Oops, we get the delivery. Oh, Casca set. What is going on out there? I didn't order any more. Hold on a second, I go see. Him. I feel like Mark got a toy. That is all I have for this package. I'm gonna get over to the next part of the video. Again, this is my honest reaction to the stuff in the second part because I hadn't seen any of this stuff yet. I've already seen the first package, but not the second package. So let's go do that. <laughs> Okay, you guys, I finally got the second package. That was totally my fault. I put the wrong address. I'm not new. I don't know how I did that. Anyways, so I got the second package. This is the bigger one of the two for my Timu order. Still in the package. I haven't opened it. I figure I might as well do it on camera to show you guys exactly what it's really like. Oh, and my window is open and it is beautiful out. Like I went out in a t-shirt. Anywho, let's open this. Oh, I never like to cut the bag because there's bags in bags. Whoa. There's so many little boxes. Such weird packaging. All right, let's do this. Oh, oh. Okay, so there's stamps. You literally put them in ink, like a stamp, <laughs> stamp on paper. But, oh, okay. I think they're gonna be kind of nice. They're cute, right? I will report back to you on that one. I need to get a stamp pad now. <laughs> Another order. No, I'm just kidding. I think uh, I think my mom said she had stamp pads. What is this? Oh, for my air dry clay. How cute. They're like rubber locks and a key. I feel like my mom and I are gonna have some fun with these. These are really cute. Let's open all the little things first. <gasps> These ones I was looking forward to. They are adorable. They don't smell like metal. <laughs> Cute, right? Ooh, so this is like the one that we got for the girls. Now instead of them, it's for us. Little bamboo lid, little Q-tip holder. That was a couple bucks as well. I wanted to get both to see what they were like because we need a cute little one in our bathroom anyway, so that's a bonus. You guys, you know I'm all about taking things out of their boxes and put it in fancy things, so let's move on. <gasps> Ooh, uh, all these treasures. Oh my gosh, I just kicked the camera, sorry. Okay, let me pause this because I'm gonna open all of this packaging. Just one second. I find the clothes a little bit pricier than the Sheen or Shen or however you pronounce it. Exact same stuff, just a different like name of the company. Okay, I lied. I'm not opening all these packagings, but I will show you the one I did. Oh, uh-oh, 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 man down. Earring down, and it, it came apart. What? Oh, you must have to put them together. 
All right, I can do this. Okay, so obviously there's two of them. <gasps> but look at how cute they are. Look, those are cute. You might see me sporting these in a video. Far so good, you guys. These are like, oh, these are cute. So same idea as the key mold, but look, little Christmas trees or little pine trees of sort. Those are cute. Oh, I might actually keep the pack for this. Oh, this is the multi-pack. I love the dangly earring, even though I'm not wearing them right now, but. So this I paid up. They were like, I don't know, three something. Those are cute. Yes, 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 yes. Now let's bust into the clothes. Our younger daughter has not tried any of this stuff on yet, and I will try this stuff on and show you when I try it on. I'm a little scared. Oh, those are cute. Okay, there's the gray pant. Oh, this is a, a very slinky tank top. So this is not an easy task, by the way, to have a full length video of yourself uh, when you're tall. <laughs> I sometimes have a problem with things actually going to the floor, pants and such, but these are actually great. I'm just gonna step up here so you can see. They are actually very roomy. I got them both in the extra large. Now, you guys, their pants, they fit me great. They might be a little baggy at the front, but I'd rather that than, you know, you bend over and your arse rips. Anyways, so there's that. And my mom does sew, so I could totally get her to customize anything really because she's kind of magical that way <laughs> so now this top actually it's very comfortable i had to tie up the little straps a little bit tighter which is totally fine obviously but i do find it a little baggy so i might get her to take in the sides a little tiny bit although it's hard to say depending on the bra you wear with it but overall it's comfortable i'd say yes for this yeah, I don't know that I'm necessarily gonna wear them together, even though it doesn't look horrible. I did size up, so I'm being honest with you, I don't like setting things back, unless they're like local, but this ain't. So I'm keeping it. So I'm glad it fit on the bigger side. Let's go there. It's the next outfit, you ready? This outfit, ah, uh, hello, has pockets. Who doesn't love a good pocket? But again, it is pretty roomy. It's very like, kind of silky satiny. So I am not sad about this outfit either. It is pants, as you can see, but if they're very wide leg pant. And I think that this was a winner too. I'm pretty happy with this. Oh, I forgot to show you these earrings. Have <laughs> you ever see that joke? Oh yeah, I'm not to brag or anything, but my earrings that I had in high school still fit. <laughs> but so I knew that these would fit me. <laughs> <laughs> and again, I did get this in the extra large because I was worried that it didn't fit. I think I'm okay with it being a bit bigger because why not? Then you can let her all hang out. <laughs> Okay, so new day. Before I wrap up this video, there are two more things that I want to show you that I got for our younger daughter. There was literally two pieces. Yes and no, it was a 50-50. There was this green little number and this little denim number. They're both an 810. I sized up for her thinking that, you know, worst comes to worst, my mom could always take it in. The dress I wasn't too concerned about, but the one piece item, this green little number. Now it's very stretchy, so I wasn't concerned that it wouldn't fit her in the actual body. Obviously it would, and it has a drawstring, so I thought for some reason it is big on her, which it was. It could cinch it, no problem. She's long in the body like myself. I was worried that maybe it wouldn't fit in areas that we need it to fit. <laughs> so uh, she tried it on and she's like, no, <laughs> not happening. And understandably so, it was, it was just way too short in the body. Not a big deal. It older daughter is like shorter than her. So I feel that that will probably fit her. And if it doesn't fit her, I can give it to my niece who would I'm sure be more than happy with it. So that was definitely a no go for who I intended it to be for, which again, not a big deal because it will be handed to somebody. It's not gonna go to waste obviously because there's a lot of girls in my family. <laughs> now this next little item, cute as a bug on, very comfortable. It's gonna be very light for summer. Oh my gosh, you guys. And I completely forgot to say the most important thing. Uh, it has pockets, fits a phone perfectly. So I'm sure she'll be very happy about that one. How fun is that? So pretty good, right? So overall, 
I'd say two thumbs up. <laughs> you guys, I hope you enjoyed this video. I had a lot of fun making it. I want to say thank you so much for stopping by. You've been here before. Thank you for coming back and watching our shenanigans. <laughs> and if you're new here, well, thank you as well for coming by. We were happy to have you today. We do all kinds of DIY videos and thrifting videos, upcycling videos, yard sailing videos. Oh, with that, you guys, we have our spring video up. I just put it up last weekend. Go on over and check that out if you haven't already. It was fun. We are ready. Mother Nature isn't cooperating, but we're ready and waiting very patiently, might I add. Anyways, you guys, thanks again, and I will see you in the next video. <laughs> Bye. Myself, my daughter. Um, <clears throat> I didn't get any from work.